Merry Christmas! My name is David Kenny, and I'm the pastor of Walden Community Church here in Montgomery, Texas, and it's December 2nd. Yep, December 2nd, and we are going through our Advent reading, our devotional. Every single year, uh, we print off a little devotional that has readings a uh, little thing to read for the holidays from December 1st all the way to Christmas Day. We gave them out this last Sunday in church, but we realized that not everybody got one. And so what I wanted to do was just sit in front of the Christmas tree and turn to the page, read it for you so that we all felt uh, like we were included. And so today's reading is called God's Gift of Grace. And it starts with a passage from Romans 5 verse 17. For if... Because of one man's trespass, death reigned through that one man. Much more will those who receive the abundance of grace and the free gift of righteousness reign in life through the one man, Jesus Christ. You know, all of humanity is important to God. But at our core, we are deeply broken and wounded. In the Garden of Eden, humanity was given a choice, and despite the closeness of having an intimate relationship with God, humanity fell into sin and darkness. Our earthen grandparents rejected God's gifts and decided to follow their own path, and that led to their destruction. But the peace of Christmas is the realization that while we are all deeply wounded by sin, at the same time, we are also deeply loved. The fall that took away our innocence was powerless to take away God's devotion. And Paul reminds us here that we have a free gift of grace and righteousness waiting for us underneath the tree of life. The baby born on Christmas Day was all part of God's master plan. This Christmas, let go of the stress to find that perfect gift and find peace in the reality that the greatest gift was grace, which gives all of humanity forgiveness and eternal life. Lord of all creation, we realize this Christmas season that our deepest need is to be forgiven. Thank you for the gift of your Son, the cross, which was the greatest gift the world could ever receive. Guide us toward peace this Christmas season. Show us the true gifts that are available to each believer who knows you and loves you. And may we always trust you and follow you completely in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you for watching. Be sure to turn in tomorrow for our December 3rd's reading. Hey, and one more thing before you go. I want to take a moment to remind you about our Christmas Eve services. We actually have two opportunities for worship on December 24th. We'll have a service at 5 p.m. and a service at 7 p.m., both of which are completely identical. Pick the service that works the best for you and your family. Our church has really enjoyed serving you and worshiping alongside of you this year. We would love to be the church where you live. If you'd like to learn more about us, you can find us at waldenchurch.com. I love you guys, and I'll see you soon. Bye.